com there's an audience. There's an audience now, an audience can be formed, so if you have anything to say, you can find an audience for what you have to say. And there's, amazingly, there's an audience for code. There's people all over the world that care how code works. Now, uh, there's, you know, you know it's kind of like poetry. poetry. Poets write poetry for other poets. I think coders write code for other coders. But there's, there, uh, 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 and poetry has, uh, you know, maybe we can't really understand love without poetry. Well, you know, we can't make the modern world work without code. And so we have this uh, 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 dependence on code to make the modern world work. And we're just now, you know, coming to realize uh, how, well, I think we've always realized how, you know, some people could write code 10 times, 100 times, maybe 1,000 times faster than somebody else. But we just said, well, that's just that's weird, but, but now we're saying, what is it? It's, a, it's about the ability to write code that communicates and the ability to capture abstractions in it and having a process that values abstraction. You know, one of the keys that, uh, uh, you, you know, there's the saying, if it isn't broke, don't fix it. Well, you can have a program that works just fine, but doesn't say what it needs to do as best as it can. And, and so what we do is we make sure that that a developer, after he gets the program working, can take the time to make the, the expression of what it does as clear as possible. Now, the unit testing shows up in there because you know it works because you're passing the test. So you write some tests, then you write the code that passes the test, and then you say, is that the clearest expression of what I'm trying to do? And if it isn't, you, you change it. You refactor it. You make it different. Now, most people, once it's working, they don't want to touch it because they're afraid they'll lose the working. But we have the tests there that are checking that. So we can refactor. And the refactoring, what does it mean to be an expressive program? Well, what does it mean to be an expressive poem? You know, there's, there's, there's a sense there of understanding what does and doesn't communicate. The only way we'll get good at that is to practice communicating. So we show each other code and we say, look at this. What does this say? That that's, develops the art of expressing utility. So and, if you're a one-guy shop, would you recommend that guy publish a weblog and post code? Oh, absolutely. Everything? Absolutely. And, and watch for the feedback to come in? Sure. And, mm -hmm. I think that that's, you know, the... the, the <laughs> well, now, now, uh, now Wiki... It's interesting. I, I love the uh, the evolving blogs, and I love wikis, and they are so complementary. They're, they're they're so you know one one is is you kind of lose your identity, and you know you're just uh, uh, well refactoring the text, just like we were talking about refactoring code. You can refactor the text of a posting. You know, if I write something into a wiki, you know, it'll be gone. It'll be digested and turned into something else. Now, hopefully, the thought is still there. Hopefully, it's getting better with that. Now, now the blogs are, are, are interesting because you can say something, and if people find you interesting, you will be rewarded for it because people will pay attention. You know, you say something, if you, and so that really encourages you to say things that people care about. But then there's this network that is kind of like a wiki in terms of perfecting the message, but that it exists a level higher in the blogosphere, right? You know, here I'm telling the blogging expert about the blogosphere, but it's, it's, uh, uh, it's all very much about perfecting the message, being able, being able to say something when, uh, you know, at one point we thought it was easy to explain things, but we, would, we deal with ideas that are so complicated in the world that we have to practice saying it to find a way to articulate what matters.